Hi, my name is Michael. This is obviously Alfie Best. Everyone knows Alfie. Um, I'm here to deliver two suits to Alfie Best um, and also make him a beautiful third suit for his premiere of his movie, The Gypsy Billionaire. Um, but I want to ask you some questions about why people should wear suits. Why do you still, why on earth would you wear a suit on in Cannes, in France, warm, nice, not a t-shirt and flip-flops. That's the weather to wear a, uh, you know, that sort of clothing, not a, a suit. Why would you wear a suit to your premiere of your movie? Okay, there's an old synergy is dress up and show up. Mm -hmm. You know, dress down and stay down is not what you want to do. <laughs> and it doesn't matter whether you're in Cannes, it doesn't matter whether you're in Brixton, it doesn't matter whether you're in Forest Gate, it doesn't matter whether you're in Asker. It's irrelevant. A man that feels good about himself um, is always going to do better in the day because everything is about mindset. And what a suit does for you, a suit is your armor. Now, I don't wear a suit every day, but there are occasions, at least once or twice a week, I wear a suit. And a suit says an awful lot about, it's your armor. When you go into battle, you need to feel polished. Mm -hmm. You need to feel in charge of your own destiny. And that's what a suit does for you, mm -hmm. you know. And you can obviously have a play with a suit, like, like we did as well. I remember when we first talked about this, you said, okay, I want to have a, not just a normal suit. Don't make me a, a Navy suit. Make me something that we cannot really get anywhere else. It has to be something unique because we now can play with a suit. We can put, a bright, a bright orange lining. We can put some nice, beautiful lapels on a suit, right? We Look, don't necessarily have to have. Fashion, yeah. fashion has moved on. Mm -hmm. And what a lot of people have all begun to realize, and especially myself, and that's through the help of you, Michael, mm -hmm. that we've all got our own unique style. And bringing a, a tailor on board, a specialist tailor like yourself. Mm -hmm. um, and look, this is not me giving you uh, uh, credit where I feel it's due anyway. This is me saying, you're willing to explore. And um, you know, we sat down and spoke about the sort of suits you were gonna make for me. And you, and you, it was you that actually said to me, they need to exuberate your own personality. You know, what, what it says about you. And what I've realized is this, the man that's seen in the room is the man that people wanna talk to in the room. And when you're doing business, that's important mm -hmm. because the old synergy is this. It's not who you know that makes the difference. It's who knows you that makes a difference. Because if people know you, they want to do business with you. Now, could you say that the suits you've made for me are a little bit outlandish? Actually, no. <laughs> okay. Actually, no. Okay. Because I'm wearing them. Yes. And I'm an outlandish type of person. Yeah. You so, just carried off just so easily because it's not going to be uncomfortable and it's not you're not dressing up you just you just wear it like you would normally a suit this is a normal suit for you this is not a, a dressed up version well look we all date yeah. different types of people mm -hmm. that's no different than wearing different types of clothes mm -hmm. it's the same mm -hmm. some people like different types of relationships, mm -hmm. as in they might like a, a lady that's fiery, others may like them to be knowledgeable, some, you know, different types. With clothes, it's exactly the same thing. I think of clothes as my armor, mm -hmm. and they say a lot about you. Whether somebody likes them or dislikes them, they're gonna have an opinion about them. Mm -hmm. If they have an opinion about them, they're talking about you. Mm -hmm. And whether it's good or whether it's bad, at least they're talking about you and not somebody else. Mm. And uh, the one that we're actually making for the premiere of the movie is going to be something special, one-off again. Uh, things that you cannot buy in the shop, you cannot find. These are just beautifully custom-made um, suits for you. Uh, and they're going to be on show in some weeks, I guess. So we're going to be able to... On the, no on the 19th of Cannes, we're going to be wearing them um, on the... Uh, VIP launch, it's for 60 people maximum. They're for people that were involved in making the film documentary. Um, you know, Vandercom Films 
made the documentary. You were the tailor and the wardroom uh, expert on the film. So, you know, that, that carries its own weight in its own. And look, for me, for somebody who's an ambassador of your suits, I can't recommend them highly enough. Amazing. Um, last thing, how would you inspire? What would you say to inspire? Uh, younger generation, you know, uh, Fabian, who's behind the camera here, uh, 23 years old, why would he wear a suit? No one his generation, you know, we old school, I'm 40, you 40 plus. How, how do we inspire younger people to actually say, listen, there is a place of hoodie, there is a place of trainers, but also there is a place for suit, even for younger generation. What would you say to them? Why would they, why should they wear a suit? Let me tell you, nobody should wear a suit. Okay. Nobody should wear a hoodie. Nobody should wear baggy jeans that are hanging down. But what everybody should be is smart. Mm. Everybody should be well-dressed. I'll tell you why. Because smart people exude confidence. People that are well-dressed exude confidence. And that's what a suit does for you. And like every trend, you know, hoodies and track suits, their time has now come. And I actually think suits are coming back. And the reason I say that suits are coming back, suits are coming back in different styles. They're coming back with a pull string. So they're actually between um, a track suit and a suit. And you are now finding that actually the younger generation are wearing suits, but they're wearing higher up the leg, shorter in the trouser, a little bit longer in the jacket, and they're in a pull string suit. Yeah. And look, what I would say is, so it's not about what somebody should wear. Mm -hmm. We're now in that, and you're ahead of your time by saying people are wearing suits. Actually, it's actually the fashion that's now taken that pendulum swing, and I think you're gonna see more and more and more people wearing the hybrid suit. Love it. Amazing. Thank you so much. Pleasure. Thank you. <laughs>